And other local news we're following tonight. Heavy rain early this morning soaked much of northeast Wisconsin. But for those in Manitowoc County, the village of Valders, they got just over six inches of rain in just a matter of hours. Tonight, NBC 26's Eric Kress shares how it impacted the community of just under 1,000 people. A brand new pond has taken shape in front of Valders Elementary School. Problem is, there's never been a pond there. In this area right here, there's probably about two to three feet of water. The village's public works director, Mark Stephanie, says the rain started coming at about 11 p.m. Wednesday night. It was just raining as hard as I've ever seen it rain. The onslaught of rain managed to flood basements, close roads, and jumpstart pumps in basements across town. And the precipitation didn't let up for hours. It's just the amount of water and the speed with which it came overwhelmed our uh, uh, collection system and our um, storm sewer system. So No water managed to make it into the school, but just about a mile away at this trailer court, dozens of residents were dealing with the rain's aftermath. And I looked outside and it, there was, I, I have to say, at least two feet of water. I mean, up to the fourth step on my porch. And Jenna Swetlick and her family watched as their yard swelled up with rainwater. All they and their neighbors could do was watch as it filled up their cars and inched ever closer to their front doors. So it was like up to about three quarter way on the skirting of all the trailers. And it was just like, how did it get that bad in that span of time? Thankfully, few here saw the water make its way inside of their homes, but several vehicles are not starting here today. And many are left wondering if the items left in their shed or even yards will be salvageable. All of my stuff in my shed is ruined, <laughs> including his drum set, but that's all replaceable. In the village of Valder, Eric Crest, NBC 26.